Hello, it is me, and I'm back with a fashion video featuring my 20 week pregnant body. I am with child, and now more than ever, I value comfort. But hey, we can still be cute and chic too. Huge thank you to Crocs for sponsoring this video. Crocs makes the most delightfully comfortable shoes in the world, and my feet have never felt so blessed. You can grab all of these styles at your closest Crocs store or online at crocs.com. So let's start things off with a classic gen look. We've got the beret, the blouse, the statement trousers, and of course, the platform wedges. These are the Brooklyn Low Wedges from Crocs. These are a two-strap silhouette with heel straps, so you are secure. They're so lightweight, and trust me, you will feel like you're walking on air with these. All right, let's bring out the bump and rock a cute little puff crop top. This summer is gonna be a scorcher, so I just wanna be prepared. I feel so free in this outfit because there's a ton of stretch and my Crocs got my feet cushioned. Also, how satisfying is the fact that my sole is the exact same color as these flares? Perfection. So an easy way to switch up this look is by throwing on a structured blazer. I feel so powerful in this look. I think it's the strong shoulders. This is like the big spring energy that I wanna channel. This also gives me the option to show off the bump, or if I'm feeling shy, I can just cover it up and carry on. The second museums are open again, I am charging through the doors wearing this fit. She is cultured, well-traveled. She's a dilettante of the arts, if you will. I added a thin trench and a beret to channel my inner art critic and of course my Crocs to wander around the exhibitions. Let's get bold, baby! How trippy and wonderful are these pants? They're like a funky optical illusion. I switched out my Brooklyn Low Wedges for an all black pair. Guys, I can't emphasize how comfortable these are. The soft, flexible matte light uppers feel like they're broken in from day one. I would probably wear this window shopping on that like trendy block in your neighborhood. It's perfect for that. So let's tone things down with a hoodie. This is actually a hoodie that I wear just around the house, but I love how it grounds the intensity of the pants and it makes everything look pretty casual. I threw on a little bucket hat, silver jewelry, and then kept my toes breezy in my Crocs. So I made this outfit more appropriate for the evening by throwing on my massive vintage leather jacket. I feel like Lisa Bonet in the 90s in this look because it's so bold with tons of texture and print. I love this edgy but comfy look. Oh yes, come through with the coordination. Honestly, this kind of looks like a PJ set. Like you just rolled out of bed and you're like, oh hey, I'm here at brunch, sorry I'm a little late. I made this look like an actual outfit by adding my cool girl black sunnies and a black leather bag. The Crocs add a little bit of height to make it just a little bit more formal. So I'm just unbuttoning the top and revealing my crop tank. This outfit's already so vertigo inducing that, you know, I'm just gonna add this fuzzy zebra printed beret. This look is a full blown commitment. Like you are definitely gonna be turning heads in this outfit. So now I'm just gonna sweeten things up and put on my pilgrim style blouse again. This huge collar just makes everything look more precious. I feel like this is less in your face, but you're still making a huge statement. So I'm just kind of freestyling here and adding my huge vintage leather jacket, throw on a beanie, and hey, I don't hate it. You can wear this to a drive-in perhaps, or maybe have a long introspective talk in a parking lot in this outfit. So here we have an active outfit. I'm wearing my Crocs Tulum toe post sandals. I love the accessibility of these. You can just slip in and out of them so easily. These are gonna be so clutch, especially when my belly gets too big. It's gonna be hard for me to reach down and like do the straps for my shoes. So these are gonna be so perfect for that. They're so lightweight and you can dress them up or down. I said yes to this dress. Oh, I love this beige beauty. I'm gonna be able to wear it for months. I paired it with the Crocs Tulum sandal in white. These have asymmetrical straps made out of that same soft, flexible matte light material. You do not have to worry about hard straps digging into your feet. These just cushion your precious tootsies. 
For accessories, I added this extremely unpractical bag. It only looks good when there's nothing inside. I also added some pearl and gold accessories and a sun hat. And boom, you're ready to go to that pool party and boogie, baby. So I'm just gonna add some fun layers to this look. I'm throwing on that structured double-breasted blazer and a little beret and an armpit bag. It's just like one of those bags that just fit underneath your armpit. This outfit is perfect for the summer nights ahead or just like a brisk spring morning. So I decided to layer the dress with a fitted cream turtleneck and a straw chain bag. I might be pushing it with this statement, but I guarantee that this is a flattering silhouette on anyone. Anyone, seriously. Like how could it not look good? Okay, I might be really pushing it with the layering, but I think this pilgrim blouse underneath looks pretty sweet. Like I, I know, I kind of look like I'm five years old, but it's youthful, right? It's fresh, I don't know. I added some pearl accents and that totally unpractical bag. So we're keeping it casual and cute in a big tee and biker shorts. Honestly, this is a combo that I always wear when I just wanna be incognito about my bump. I'm wearing the Crocs Brooklyn Low Wedges again, but this time in this cute blush color. I decided to edge it up by adding a little bucket hat, sunnies, and my black chain purse. So I'm switching back into my beige flares again for a cute little pink summer moment. <laughs> I added a statement pearl bag for a punch of color and a little straw hat to protect me from the sun. Also, pro tip, an easy way to make a baggy tee look more put together is just to roll up the sleeves. It's such a quick fix. Another easy way to style a big tee is to grab all the fabric at the end and make a knot. I switched out the straw hat for a straw visor. I feel like the cool mom on the block picking up her kid from practice. I love this look. This is just like a cute little pastel watermelon moment. I layered it with the big colored blouse. Just the vest skims very nicely over the belly and I feel so fresh in this look. For my next look, I decided to layer it with a turtleneck instead. This outfit kind of looks academic, which I love, like maybe a private school from the 70s. It's funky, it's whimsical, and definitely comfy. I'm going to attempt to squeeze into a tennis skirt. Like, I can't even zip this all the way up, but you know what? You can't even tell, because the vest covers it. I am back with another baggy tee and biker shorts combo. I cannot get enough of this formula. It is foolproof. I switched my shoes to the Crocs Tulum toe post sandals because this is one of those outfits where you're just like rushing out of the door and you don't have time to like fumble with any straps. This is just like one of those in and out outfits. Let's make things a little sexy. I'm busting out these black stretchy flares and then I'm pairing it with my Crocs Brooklyn Low Wedges in all black again. I added my sunnies and my black chain bag and boom, she's chic and ready to roll. This is my final look and I'm transitioning it to the evening by adding a boxy cropped leather jacket and another long strap bag. I think this would be perf for date night. Maybe have a little mugtail, maybe have a little walk. Ooh yeah, let's get crazy. Okay everyone, that is a wrap and those were all the looks. Thank you again to Crocs for sponsoring this video. I am unbelievably exhausted y'all. That took out everything out of me. <laughs> so I'm just gonna rest, but let me know what look you like the best and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.